it's time for some old school gaming, some retro gaming. And as you can see, I'm going to be playing Super Mario Bros. 2 in this episode on the Nintendo Entertainment System. Um, so this is the first ever Mario game I played. Um, please select player. Okay, so I will go through all of the characters in this game. I'll, I'll play as all of them and show you their different skill sets. I'm sure most of you have played this game, but just in case you haven't. And also, there is one character who I do not like using in this game. And I'll get to why when I choose that character. It's not Princess. I think Princess is cool because you can do that. You can hover. Um, yeah, so Super Mario Bros. 2... We all know the actual real Super Mario Bros. 2 released in Japan isn't this. It was later released as Lost Levels. But, um, like I say, this was the first Mario Bros. I played because this is what we got in the PAL regions or in the West. And I loved it. I absolutely loved it. So, I had the NES pack with Turtles, if anyone remembers that, that bundle. And Turtles was okay. It was a, it was a decent game. Um, but then, like, a week or so later, my dad came home from work with a game each for my brother and I. And my brother received Mega Man 2, and I received this. And it turned out that I actually preferred Mega Man 2, because Mega Man 2 is one of my favourite video games of all time. Um, but this was damn good. And then, obviously, I played all the Mario games afterwards because I love this so much. And they are very different compared to this. Um, but yeah, Mario Bros. 1, I didn't play till much later. And I've said this on the channel before, and I won't keep going on about it. But Mario Bros. 1, I think, for its time, was incredible. But I'm not that keen on playing it Uh in this day and age. I just don't like the fact you can't go back. It's just, it's as simple as that. But anyway, Mario Bros. 2, yeah. So this is obviously based on Doki Doki Panic. It's more or less the same game, except with different characters. Has it got different music as well? I think this has got different music. I don't know. I don't know about that. I'll need to play some Doki Doki Panic again, because I can't remember. Anyway, Princess, yeah, she hovers. That's her skill. And I liked that about this game. Now, Mario Brothers 2, I think some people don't like it at all, do they? This version. Um, but some people love it. And I like how unique and different it is, personally. And I also think the Shy Guys are cooler than the Goombas. I think Shy Guys are amazing. So you've got the red ones that just walk off the edge of cliffs. But I've, I've uh, made time stand still with that object, so everyone's just chilling. Um, and then you've got the pink shy guys that don't leave the edges. They'll just keep walking left and right. There they are. But yeah, they're cool, the shy guys. I love them. And then they did feature in later Mario games, I think, didn't they? I think you can actually play as one in Mario Kart 8. Pretty sure you can. But anyway... I like this game. I like the level design. I like how you get this vertical level design. And then you've got your usual horizontal Mario level design. And it was just... Uh, for its time, I was really impressed with the graphics. I thought it looked gorgeous when I was a kid. And yeah, it was just so enjoyable. Very challenging. This game does get hard. Oh, no, 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 no. I haven't played this since the 90s. Like... 93, 94, like a long time ago. Because in Mario All-Stars, I never owned Mario All-Stars, but I did borrow it from a friend because I just wanted to see what Mario 3 looked like on the SNES. But um, was this on there? Even if this was on there, I didn't play it. So yeah, I haven't played this for many, many years. Oh, come on, i got to do this. But if I get hit once, it is game over. Or, or rather, I have to start from... I can't remember the checkpoints in this. Would it be from the beginning of the stage? But anyway, we don't need to worry about that. I'm a genius at Mario 2. I'm not. Oh, okay. Is there an actual skill to this? Or is it just 
hit the buttons and hope for the best. Oh, I remember this. I think cherries give you lives, don't they? I don't play fruit machines, so... Yeah. Oh, there we go. We get the uh, player one up. We get the extra life. Anyway. Let's play as the main man. So, Mario... Is just like a jack of all trades, master of none, I guess, in this in this Mario game. He doesn't do anything bad, but he doesn't do any I'm I'm not explaining this well, but yeah, he, he's just like an average all rounder kind of dude. So he's a safe bet to use on basically any stage. Can I go down one of those? I wanna use this potion first though. Oh, that'll do me. There we go. So yeah, the mushrooms in this work a little bit differently, as you can see from my little energy bar on the left, top left-hand side there. Oh, this thing used to spook me when I was a kid. It will just chase me now because I've took his key. But I've done okay there, and we're in the door. Yeah, the mushrooms work slightly different. You can see my little energy bar. I don't know the maximum amount you can have. Is it four? Or is it three? As I take a hit from the shy guy there, so I've lost the chunk of energy. I liked all this about this Mario, though. These little puzzly bits where you got to use your bombs and get through walls and that kind of thing. It's such a cool game. Where does it hold up, though, guys? Where does this... Yeah, where does this rank... In, in your Mario's, in the League of Mario's. Oh no, I can't get down there, I'm too big. Damn it. Yeah, it's a it's a tricky one for me. No, no! <laughs> yeah, I'm thinking about that. I'm thinking, give me a couple of seconds. So my favorite Mario of all time, everyone knows, or if you're a regular to the channel, you already know, it's Super Mario 3 on the NES. And then Mario 64 is probably my second favourite Mario game. And then maybe Galaxy. Like this, this wouldn't even get in my top five, I don't think. It's, it's damn good though. I don't think there's a Mario game that I don't like. Maybe apart from Mario 1 and Mario Lost Levels. Both of those, I've just never ever got any... Uh, eagerness to play them just it's just not for me they're, they're good games for sure but just yeah i haven't got the energy for them oh come on oh. <laughs> you got yoshi's island as well is that mario world 2 i loved that game people don't know and i respect that oh what am i doing I'm not doing well at this at all. Yeah, I like Yoshi's Island. Um, I liked Mario World. Didn't love it like some people. Some people say that's the best Mario game. And I liked it. It came. It was bundled with my snares. A lot of memories. I had the snares around release. I was lucky enough. My granddad bought me one for my birthday. And it's... I found Mario World, it, it, I don't want to say it's too easy, I always say that, it's not easy per se, it's just, it throws too many goodies at you too soon, like, as soon as you unlock all the Switch palaces, now I know I'm going way off topic of Mario 2 here, but it's Mario, but all those Switch palaces that it, it, it gives you the option to unlock, you don't have to, and then once you've done that, I, I found that game a cakewalk, is that a saying? A cakewalk? I'm sure it is. Um, whereas all the other Mario games I find extremely challenging. Okay. What are these things called? Are they called... Is he called Birdo? He's not called Birdo, is he? Is he? Oh, that was close. That was so close. Oh, I'm nervous. I'm not nervous. That's the wrong word. 
I'm I'm a bit panicky here because I don't want to. I've died enough so far in this video. I don't want to die again. Especially when I'm mini Mario, who looks like he's just a head. There we go. Okay. Yeah, this game's cool. It still looks really nice as well. It still it feels good to play. Oh, that was close. Oh, look at that. A five up. So, um, yeah. Let's get this out of the way. <laughs> I think World 1-3 is the place to use Luigi. It's either Luigi or Princess for this stage. Um, but this is why I don't like Luigi. He, he, he can jump really far, basically. But he's cumbersome as all hell to control. So I'm going to struggle. Because I just generally do not like using oh, <laughs> Luigi for this. It's a funny one because... Oh, there you go. I'm going to blame Luigi now. Every time I die, at least I've got a, an excuse. Um, yeah, because this was the first Mario game I played... Um, I always just then associated Luigi with, with being cumbersome, but also being able to jump really far. And it's like, then you play all the other games, and it's like, Luigi... Well, you could only play as him if you were playing with a friend, and you were player two. He was just exactly the same as Mario, except he was green. But yeah, that's... All the memories coming flooding back, I love it. Oh, not again. There you go. His little feet just wobble around. I've just thought of another Mario game that I love. I've actually featured that on this very playlist on Old School. Mario... I can't remember the exact name of it, but Mario 2 on the Game Boy. Was it six golden coins or something? That was incredible. Oh, that game. That would be my top ten list, that game, for sure, Mario's. And I can't comment on Odyssey. I still haven't played it. I know I need to play that game. Love the music in this game. Love the music in Mario games in general. Ooh. But yeah, this guy is... Uh, he's hard work to control. I think the general consensus when playing this game is that Princess is the is the best. I'm pretty sure that's the case. And this guy's the worst. And then Mario and Toad are just like, whatever. No. Yes, here we go. Okay. Can I go down there? Oh. <laughs> What a waste of a star, man. Oh, I remember this. Oh! Do I go down or up first? I think you go up first, don't you? I'm just ahead. Right, okay. But yeah, like I said, I like all the little puzzling elements to Mario 2. It's a very good game. It's a very good game, but I respect why some people feel that it's a bit of a a fraud, if you like, due to it being Doki Doki Panic. But I'm fine with that. Like, ooh, when I was a kid, I didn't even know Doki Doki Panic existed. I just thought this was Mario 2. I didn't know about the politics behind it all. And Mario Lost Levels, I think it, th I think this is a better game, personally. So I'm I'm glad this is this is the Mario Two that we all know and love. Well, I love. Oh, this is fiddly. It's fiddly with Luigi. Okay. Oh, I can make that jump though. Oh, it's gonna be. Oh, no, 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 no. No. Right. No, didn't mean to do that. Do, 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 do. Let's go down here for a look. Maybe you do go down first. 
I vaguely remember this. Oh, that was close. That was close. Oh, no, 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 no. So, yeah, you do got to the top first because I got to get the key to come back down here. But then I'll have that one of those key master dudes. There is a that He has actually got a name. The thing that I said spooked me when I was a kid. He'll chase me all the way down here. But I, I, I have to do it to progress this game. Okay. Oh. Oh, I don't like just being ahead. I feel <laughs> I feel vulnerable. Okay. Oh, that was terrible. But I have to use these things, don't I, to get up there. I think when I do get up there, I'll go the left. To the left-hand side and go up that way. No, 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 no. I really thought I was a goner. Okay, here we go. Just wait for him to go round like that. Just slowly and surely here. And... Oh, I don't like this bit up here, though. I'm sure... No, 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 no. That's not the way to do it. But I am sure this is the way you're supposed to do it, isn't it? Through that little jump up through that gap onto that. No, it's not that, is it? Oh, I need. Yeah. There you go. How could I forget that this gameplay mechanic is included in this game? How could I forget that? The super jump, or whatever it's called, the charge jump. I knew I was forgetting something fundamentally important to this <laughs> to this platform, and that was it. But uh, that's just silly, right? We'll get there in the end. We always do. That was terrible. What was that? There you go. Stop trying to complicate it and and just just do this, right? He's gonna chase. He will give chase. Oh my! Oh, there you go. Skills. Sometime I've got the skills. Sometimes. I've got the skills to pay the bills. We just don't see it enough. Right, here we go. Oh. I don't like this. Especially not with Luigi. Well, that worked out well for me. He's disappeared. The reason I threw it was to try and kill the shy guy. But he stopped chasing me now. But does he come back? Oh, there he is. This is... No, no, no. Again, 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 again. I've done it. But now there's more. <laughs> Please don't start at the beginning of the stage. Please don't. Phew. There you go. There's a good restart point, that. A good checkpoint. The game is fair. It's challenging, but it's fair. You can't ask for more from your platforming video game needs. But yeah, this game's cool. Really cool. Again, it's not Mario 3, it's not Mario 64, it's not up there with the games that I really love. I wouldn't say I love this Mario, but I really enjoy it, and I think it has stood the test of time. But yeah, please guys, let me know in the comments what you think of this game. Look out for more content coming to the channel. I'll speak to you all very soon.